Today, I'm going to be talking about single-use plastics, the problems that they cause, what we as Greenpeace have been doing about it, and how everyone here, most importantly, can get involved as well. So, I thought we'd start with a few statistics. A rubbish truck's worth of plastic enters the oceans every minute. Just add emphasis to that shocking figure, thank you very much. Nine in ten seabirds and one in three turtles have ingested plastic. Supermarkets produce over 800,000 tonnes of plastic packaging every year in the UK alone. Now, I have some difficulty in conceptualising such a big figure, so I worked it out to help us understand. That's the equivalent weight of 45,714 Lothian double-decker buses with passengers in them. <laughs> well, you might think, well, at least we can recycle all that. It's not the biggest issue. We've got a solution. Please remember that only 9% of all plastic ever, ever produced has been recycled. These figures shock me every time I hear them and every time I say them. And you might be wondering, quite rightly, well, what has Greenpeace been doing about this and how can I get involved? Well, we at Greenpeace know that the climate crises that we faced were not caused by individuals going about their business, doing their shopping and putting food on the table. They were caused by big business putting convenience and profit over people and planet and by successive governments refusing to take this issue seriously. So that's what we've been doing, putting pressure on those with the power to make change who have so far been reluctant to do so. So here's what we've been doing. In 2017, Green, a Greenpeace expedition to the north coast of Scotland found that plastic pollution has reached even our most pristine waters. In fact, two out of three samples that we collected had plastic in them. We use this information to inform the public, collect signatures and lobby the Scottish Government. We have since announced that they will be introducing legislation to bring about a deposit return scheme at the end of the year. We then targeted the world's biggest producer of soft drinks, Coca-Cola, who, by the way, produces over 110 billion single-use plastic bottles every year. With a message of don't let Coke choke our oceans, and with the backing of over half a million signatures, Coke have now pledged to increase the recycled content of their plastic bottles from 7 to 50% globally. But we realise that this is not enough. 